Concerns over rising COVID cases don't seem to be stopping holiday travelers this year. TSA reports over 2 million passengers were screened at checkpoints across the U.S. for the third straight day Sunday. Nearly double last year's numbers, but it does fall short of pre-pandemic levels. So just how many of those travelers are here in Colorado? Well, according to AAA, it's a lot more than last year. Let's go to CBS4's Shauna Kalafi joining us live at DIA this morning. And Shauna, uh, just how many Coloradans are going to be taking a trip? Well, AAA says 1.9 million Coloradans. That's people traveling by air, by road. But either way, this is a big bounce back from last year's numbers. Of course, the travel industry, like many others, took a big hit because of the pandemic. But this year, they say those travel numbers will be on par with 2019, which actually broke records here locally. So AAA is anticipating a 32% increase in Coloradans traveling this holiday season. There, that, that includes people that are expected to make trips of 50 miles or more, either driving or flying between December 23rd and January 2nd. But because of that high demand as well as supply limitations, AAA says the cost of traveling this holiday season has also gone up since last year. Flight prices are up 5% for Christmas week and 27% if you're flying around New Year's. Hotel prices are up too. For Christmas travel, the average nightly rate is $320 a night for a mid-range AAA approved hotel. AAA says there will also be 250,000 Coloradans who are driving to travel this holiday season. And they say December 23rd is expected to be the busiest day on the roads for this year. In Denver, Shauna Kalafi covering Colorado First.